When asked how it all started, I always tell that it all began that day when we went to Botanical Gardens. We, meaning yours truly, and two of my friends. Whose idea was it to visit the abandoned station? Who persuaded the others to go? I always tell them that I don't remember. I always lie. It is a safe lie. Or there is no way to ascertain the truth. Both Vitaly and Eugene are dead now. The massive airlock doors shrugged and opened with a grinding sound, opening a road to hell for us and a road into the metro for the demons. But in fact, it all started that day when Mother said we should take a walk in the botanical gardens and go there by metro. I remember how we took a short escalator to the surface, how we exited a spacious glass pavilion and saw a street buried in green. I remember the small clouds moving across the limitless sky, and soft, cool wind on my face. Mother bought me an ice cream. That was the last time I tasted it. That day, humanity was executed. The righteous and the sinful were called to be rendered according to their deeds. And we hid from God's sight in the metro. And we were saved from his wrath. And he apparently decided that flushing us out wasn't worth the trouble. Then he went about his business or perhaps died. While we stayed on this used up and discarded earth and continued just going with it. Going nowhere. I remember so many random, unnecessary things, yet I don't remember the most important one. My mother's face. She died very soon after the war started. All that remains of her is that day in the gardens. How I wished I could recall her face. The way she looked at me. The way she whispered that I have nothing to fear sell my soul just to recall that. I'd do that any day, any time. And I did. Hello everyone, welcome back to the Unknown Assembly with our let's play of our road... How well, we do <laughs> okay then. Uh, with our let's play of Metro Last Light, going on the road to Exodus. Uh, guys, we're getting closer every day now. I'm excited. Um, when it comes to the Metro games, like I said, I always found them rather enjoyable. I just love them. A unique premise, taking the side of a Russian instead of being, you know, the gun ho American hero. America, yeah. Oh god, that's cringy. That's cringeworthy. <laughs> well, either way, um, we're going to be starting a new game and stuff like that. Uh, so, uh, I'm fire my quickly. There's actually a few things to do, so I'll just jump cut here. Welcome back, everyone. The dark ones came much later, from the garden's direction. The Dark Ones, huge, towering a full head over the highest man. Nightmarish creatures, creepy as a man turned inside out. Monsters born to destroy us. The word was they were incredibly strong and unnaturally evil. That with bare paws they could tear armed men apart. Just <laughs> That's all lies. Truth is even scarier. Oh, yes, it is, Artyom. D6. Well, actually, no, that's not D6. Eh, it's just a random thing at all. Look at that. Look at those guys. Those things are scary as hell if you saw them coming towards you. Isn't that right? Well, let's get into it. <laughs> Lovely. Well, I used to live nearby. Before the war, I mean, uh, up there. I was on the train when it happened. I tried calling my Are family, you cutting, but I couldn't get through. 
Oh no, comrades. Shit, shit! What's going on here? Uh, shadow figures, guys. Nope, 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 nope. Oh no, they're no solaces. No, Eugene, Boris. Vladimir, no, not you too, Vladimir. Why? What is going on? Vladimir, what I know. My hands are soaked in the blood of friends. Artyom, wake up, Artyom. It's me, Khan. Oh, hi, Khan. Nightmares, eh? No wonder, after all you've been through. Listen, I have incredible news. A couple of days ago, I was near the ruins of the Dark One's Hive, and I saw one of them, still alive. What? I immediately set out to find you, as you were the one they tried to contact, before you launched the missile strike against them. Khan, how the hell did you get here? Get out, now! Yes, Ullman, one moment. Oh, hey, Ullman, now you doing? If the Dark One has survived, it is vital that you try to speak with it, Artyom. I realize that, as one of the Order now, you report to Miller. Mm -hmm. But we must persuade him to allow this mission. Khan, I told you to get out! This is a classified base. You shouldn't even be here. I'll take you to Colonel Miller. Follow me, Artyom. All get right ready, Artyom. I'll be waiting at the exit. Yeah. Move it, you windbag. I knew a smoker once. During the last year of his life, he had to eat, drink, and breathe through a tiny hole in his throat. Ah, uh, the notebook. Always good. Oh, our lighter bullet. Ah, oh, that'd be awesome to have one of those. Speaking of which, um, it actually might be possible it, um, soon for a sl for about 10 people. Oh my god, I saw the video for the Artyom edition of Metro Exodus. Oh, I want it so bad, but I don't think I would get it. Well, guys, uh, I'm going to be trying to get the good ending since that is a canonical ending. Yes, I know what to do. Oh, uh, this guy's jamming out. Nice, nice. Привет, Артём. Hello there. Was one of the men who found D6. They gave him a ranger's badge on the spot. Yeah, it's nice for him. I had to spend two years as a cadet before they accepted me into the order. Well, I blew up a dark hat, well, anyway, dark, 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 dark one's hat. I suppose it's nice down here since they got the reactor working. Oh, jeez, you're missing leg. I actually never noticed that. But still, it doesn't feel right. Like, it's too damn good, you know? Quit whining. It's a gift from your ancestors. Enough to survive down here for decades. Maybe until the world up there will take us back. Ah, good moral point. That's gonna be very vital. You keep dreaming at the metros. For me, it still feels like every patrol outside could be the last. Ah, clean up. What the heck? On, That's the same. Five more sets of 30. <laughs> Look at those two rookies. Pathetic. Carry on. No wonder the colonel or the training time doubles. And Romanov's the only one who makes it there alive. You're shitting me. The rest of the group? Wiped out? The marshes are easy. You just look for the markers and flags and walk along them so you don't drown. A child could do it. Well, okay, the shrimps always gave you hell. Yeah, but shrimps what always hit the shrimps. Squat down? No idea. They found Romanov's alone at the church. Sitting on the floor praying. Since then, he doesn't eat, doesn't react to people, he just speaks to God. <laughs> Pop Romanov's not expecting an answer. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, man, I'll cut the guy some slack. His entire team got wiped out. Uh, look at him, comrade sleeping with his gun. Always good to have. You guys continue playing what, Heard chess? About what you did. Respect, man. Thank you. 
Hello, Artyom. Welcome to the armory. I hear you are a ranger now. Yeah, I've huh? been a ranger you for about a year. Must some time to celebrate. For now, let's get you equipped. So, first things first. You're going to need a gas mask. You can't make a step on the surface without a gas mask. It's been 20 years and the radiation still strong enough in some places to boil water. There are hot spots down here in the metro, too. Don't forget filters for the mask. Ah, sure, filters. it looks cool enough even without these, but they yep. definitely make it better for your oh, health. Oh yeah, definitely. I can breathe now, up there. Kids. Well, what can I say? Anything you need for survival in a stylish orange case. Hey, orange is one of my favorite Here's colors, man. Here's your advance salary for this month. Remember, your pay is in military-grade rounds. Sure, you can use them as usual. That was 160. For hefty extra damage. But saving them to buy guns, attachments, regular ammo and equipment from merchants anywhere in the metro seems like a smarter move. Oh yeah, I agree there, buddy. <laughs> now to the good stuff, huh? Let's give you some guns. Oh yes, give me the guns. Give me the guns. usually carry up to three weapons or two. Choice of those is completely up to you. Oh yes, I love this. It also gives me access to DLC weapons since it's the Redux Edition. I'll get this one, customize it, customize that bad boy. Oh yes, give me that. All right, get away from there. Choose, give me. Oh wait a second, is this? No, yeah, yeah, just make sure. I'll take. Of course, why am I sniping the shotgun? Yes, it is. Okay. No, I'll be good. Hey, Artyom, what on the show for me, huh? Try out the rest of the weapons you chose. Let's go on the south. Good shot! Now, shoot me. Yeah, I've been playing I've been playing these games forever. I know the difference. I'm good. Thank you though for the weapons. Did you hear the order? You're not to disclose the fact that D6 has been found to anyone in the metro. The colonel says someone already spilled the beans. The stations are crawling with drivers. What are you doing, Trumpy Rambo? Crazier than the last. Sure, food for 10 million, super weapons, secret machinery. And the others claim there's a radio down here powerful enough to contact the bunkers in Siberia, where the president and the government are holed up. Yeah, it's madness. Oh yeah, I, I, I actually have like madness. All right, tearing on. We're gonna get irradiated here for damn sure. No way, the base is clear. This the part we're in. They've checked the door. Yesterday, the commander and I checked the doors. Lots of them are still sealed. Some are welded shut. And there's a few that look like they were locked from inside. So what? So there's radioactive shit behind some of those doors. Hot enough to bake an egg. Wow. I can't remember the last time. I ate an egg. Look. There's a reactor here, right? On the other side of the facility. I'm not sure it's safe here. Maybe this place wasn't designed as a shelter. No idea, but I wouldn't fuck with any of the sealed doors. Miller's going to There's going to be Alright, let's get to this guy. Please, Osip, let me smoke in peace. I was on duty in the situation room yesterday, so I heard something. Seems like there's all kinds of things stirring up. What do you mean? The Reds are mobilizing. They've recruited old men, schoolboys, sent them off to training camps. I tell you, war is coming. Oh yeah, going to the Kami, there is always the usual a war. suspects, probably. The Nazis. It reminds me. The sentry stops I spotted three legal groups of Mark Stokers. Strange. Nazis have never been seen such numbers before. Three groups, you said? Where? Two of the squads came close to this place. Save yourself. The Nazis checked the base and said as if they were searching for an entry point. Shit. Think they know we found D6? Hard to say. Maybe. It's not good. If they do try to get in, they're finished. What? Miller has tripled the guards. True. He knows about the Nazis. But if we eliminate the scouts, they'll just send more. 
I think they'll get in. I think the Order can hold off the Reich. Slow down. The Order is neutral. We are the guardians of the entire Metro. We protect our fellow humans from monsters and mutants. What state would dare go to war against us? Let me finish the story. It was a third group of Nazis, remember? It was seen at exhibition at service. We had centers there, the scalpel and most. They were reporting in, so the Nazis were charging them. And the line went dead. Wait. Rost is missing in action? No, not missing. He was found dead, along with Scalpel. A dozen rounds in each one. He finished with headshots. Shit. It was just his birthday last week. We had a drink. What kind of sick fucker would do that to him? Alright. Well, the reason why I'm listening, taking my time through this is because if you listen to stories played on musical instruments and just do good deeds, like in Metro 233, you can get good morale points, which that determines the end of the game. to this clown, Alex. Open the gates! Have you heard about Lesnitsky? Lesnitsky. Check with the guards at the lab. Shit. What the hell did he do? Opening up. Oh, oh no, that's Nietzsche. All right, let's go. Oh, is that tattoo on your hand, Con? Man, I never knows that either. I don't know a lot of these things. The tombs of ancient kings were filled with whatever they might need in the end. Weapons, gold, chariots. Come on, guys, we don't have all day. They sacrificed their wives and slaves to serve their lords even in death. Reminds me of this bunker. Sir, cut that shit out. Can I get up here? No, I cannot. I cannot even jump yet. Where are you, Con? The there things you are. You in D6 right me. are like what the Conqueror took with him beyond the grave. Cold steel and wild steeds and treasures untold. What are you guys doing? Of over course, there? the Tomb Raiders would always die horribly. Except for Lara Croft. Demons or ghosts or their own greed. Con, will you shut up or what? Hey, I heard that Lesnitsky did something. What happened? Nobody knows. Lesnitsky was at the lab. When the next shift came, the door was open and the lab ransacked. Lesnitsky was gone. Shit. So, what's inside? Chemical weapons, maybe some other shit. That's, that's all I heard. Oh, lovely chemical weapons. Geneva would love that. A new one because of Lesnitsky. A red hot poker right into my soul. If I still have one. <laughs> oh, well, then you right, still have a soul. Go. If you didn't, you won't be funny. All the bunkers, the nooks and crannies and exits. But whoa. still, a base the order dreamed of finding. Yeah, I bet so. They say Hansa is strengthening the sentry points along the whole line. Especially the ones close to the Nazis. I just left the briefing. Two Nazi assault teams have started to fight with raids somewhere on the surface. Good, let the Nazis and the raids kill themselves. What are they doing on the surface in the first place? They never went there such numbers before. HQ thinks they're looking to break into this place. Well, you couldn't hide the news forever. And now they're all salivating over D6. Ah, seems like we'll have to share. With hungry wolves? <laughs> they're going to share you, bro. <laughs> and then each other. Oh god. I never touched the order before. Because the order was like a hedgehog. No meat to speak of and too much trouble getting to it. But now we have lots of meat and they all want to bite. That's actually a good Scott analogy. Most? He says it's the Nazis. Big mistake. Miller does not forget such things. We'll find those responsible in time. All of them. And they will sleep with the fishes. I've got a feeling like before the war, in the summer, when a thunderstorm was coming and the air was thick and humid, suffocating. I was two when the war started. You're talking about storms? I don't remember that shit. Hmm. I wonder if my son even knows the word storm. I'll ask him when I get home. Don't talk about home either. Man, that was some slow music right there. I liked it. All right, back. Hey, anyone know what the buzz is about? Why the summons? I hear the Reds are mobilizing. Maybe Hansa too. What's that? 
Oh, yeah, get more points. Okay, let's continue one. Nah. I got it this far. There's word the Nazis are sniffing around for our treasure. Do they know what's in here? All the weapons and shit? Well, genius, if they thought it was a diaper storage facility, they'd leave it alone. What if they find the entrances? Stone the bunker? <laughs> Any of our men is worth five reds. And the exchange rate for the Nazis is also quite favorable. You forget, the red lines got 15,000 people. They could kill with numbers alone. My god, we're what? 200? Thousands, hundreds. Arsini, this is the only sum you need to know. Zero. Kruma, That's the number we fight for. They've been so Ah, man. Yeah, oh, man. All right, go on in. I'll wait here. When you've gone, I'll speak to Miller. Why are you trying to do a, a, a premature squat right there, Ullman? Anyways, uh, the uh, the re the most up recent oh. the bombing of the dark God. ones may have been humanity's worst mistake. What if they meant us no harm, they but were did. trying to they didn't communicate? Mean us harm. Perhaps the severe pain and loss of consciousness suffered in their presence just meant we were incompatible. Machines with different wiring. But somehow you, Artyom, have the common wire. The connection with the Dark Ones. Yes. People died at exhibition. Your home station. Yeah. Hunter. The best of the order is most likely dead as he's well. He's actually not. He's and alive he somewhere. And he told you this. If we don't fight for our lives in this new world, we'll be devoured. It is the law of evolution. But I would argue the old laws no longer apply. How did, first off, how did you know he said that? And second off, that's actually a really good point. Sometimes in this new world, maybe the old wall laws don't apply. Got stuck there. All right, Arthur, and you, God, you have something to report. Nice spirit, man. Yes, Colonel. Let's keep it short then. I located the surviving Dark One at the gardens. What? One of those things is still alive? Luckily, yes. Luckily, come. This is utter madness. The Dark Ones were the greatest threat the Order's ever faced. Colonel, just. Give me a chance. A single Dark One is no threat. Artyom has a gift. I believe he can establish contact with the creature. Let him come with me. All right. Artyom, go with Khan to the gardens and locate the Dark One. I'll send a sniper along. My best. Anna. Yes, sir. Why would we need a sniper? To kill the thing. To eliminate the creature and finish the Order's job. Miller, you can't. It's murder. Restrain him. You idiot. You're making the same mistake that... We're done here. It's, it's the same mistake. What? Here. Artyom, it's your last chance for forgiveness. For getting rid of the nightmares. Ah. That could have been better animated. Forget about Khan. Yes, sir. Looks like he got close. Too close to the creature and lost his mind. Look here, Artyom. Complete the mission and get back here quickly. A war is coming, and I'll need every ranger at his post. On your way. So, what are you waiting for? Come along, rabbit. Jesus. Yeah. Artyom, if it's true that the Dark Ones can sense you, maybe you could draw it out from hiding so Anna can have a clear shot. But do me a favor. Don't let the Dark One get into your mind, or Anna will have two targets. Is that understood? Yes, sir. We now suspect Lesnitsky was a sleeper agent, but we haven't verified who's running him. Your job is to intercept him before he delivers the stolen container. Understood? Yes, sir. If Lesnitsky escapes with the container, the entire Metro is at risk. So if you can't take him alive, you damn well better bring me his head. Yes, sir. Dismissed. All right, then. Time to get to it. Hello there, Anna. How you doing? Man, you. Don't tell me you believe that bullshit about making peace with the Dark Ones. I wish I had been up in that tower myself to see the missiles fall and watch them burn in their nests. Well then, are you Come a lovely on, woman? Rabbit. Would you let those things into the metro? Let them crawl into our brains so they could use us like animals. 
Maybe we could mate with them so the children could live on the surface and Again, feed no. off the radiation. No, 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 Shit. no, no. You don't shake hands with the devil. No, you do not. Away from the edge of the platform. Rain coming in. During the beginning of the game, you are kind of annoying, but you get better. And God, I cannot wait to see All right. you in. Pop in like a good little rabbit. Can't wait to see you in Exodus and Antium's child. Yeah, but it looks like we've worn this place out. Jesus, let's move. Stop interrupting me, woman. But uh, yeah, like I was saying, it from the trailer, it looks like uh, you might have to make a choice between her and her father to save one of them. Just a year ago, I stood on top of the TV tower and saw missiles rain on the botanical gardens, turning the flesh into ashes, smelting metal and glass. Nobody and nothing could survive that inferno. Yet Khan did find a dark one there. Now my mission is to find and eliminate it. To finish what I started. Yeah, you should, Atiyam. You should always finish what you start. Train to the past. In the past, trains were ordinary things. Yes, they but were. Now, this monorail seems magic, doesn't it? Our kids won't know how to operate these things. Not unless and we train them. will probably think this was built by the gods. If we allow them to be ignorant, yeah. Alright, we reached the station. We can talk to the secret metro to run. We haven't explored these tunnels. Can't spare the time I've left far. So don't wander off. Not by one who. Come on, let me at him, let me at him. I'll try to put some juice on the system and get the lights on. Use your flashlights in the meantime. Right, you ready? Let's move. Watch yourself, the doors are closing. Good luck. Yeah, yeah, okay, you had to tell me that they were closing. Didn't you and my father take the monorail when you went out to fire the missiles at the Dark Ones? We did, yeah. That's a good sign, Rabbit. Maybe we'll have luck with this mission, too. Please stop calling me, Rabbit. Power's working. Open the gate. I'll cover the passage. Alright, then you really need me to do that? Like, seriously? Wait, I'm right here. Fine after all. Jesus Christ. Like I said, she starts out annoying, but she gets better. All clear. Move out. What is that? Oh, no, hey, oh, one second. Ah, bullets. I thought I saw a reflection. Yeah, I'm right here. I'm ahead of you. Like I said. Hey, wait, why are you getting in me? Move, I'm following. Okay, then. Go right. There's a dead end on the left. Yeah, full of graves. Can I not sprint yet? It seems like I can't sprint. Alright then, so we're gonna be going slow and orderly. Shit. That thing's fast. Yeah, and I killed it. You got reflexes, I'll give you that. Yeah, I was only holding it with one arm as well. Great, the ladder. It's just a little more walking. Give me a second. Man, poor guy. Didn't make it. Alright, back on to it. Back to hunting the dark ones. Surface, put your mask on. <sighs> With looking at my ass, it's way out of your reach, rabbit. That's what you say now. Just wait. I get to see more than just that ass. Give me a hand here. All right then. God, this game is beautiful, man. Just so beautiful. 
Let's go to the main entrance. Ah, uh, yes, now we can sprint. There. I can cover a lot of territory. Head on in and look for the creature. I'm thinking that since the Dark Ones are so fond of you, it'll sense you, or smell you, or whatever the fuck you need, and come from hiding. Just try to stay in the open so I can cover you. We'll maintain radio contact. I'm already You're way ahead of you. There. What? New Oh, well, I don't have your gift. So hop along, rabbit. Stop if calling me rabbit, god damn it. Don't worry. I'll be in a position. I can see you. Something's still burning where the nest was. That's some fine wasteland. You guys sure did a good job here. I see some kind of movement. Get ready. On the right. I'm working on them. Oh god, god, god. You're watching. Come on. Come on. How was bad luck? Get ready for more. Another three. Let's do it. Come on. Oh god, you think you can take me out? No, oh god, maybe they can. Come on, come on. Jesus, you are a horrible shot. You're shooting at nothing. I did. You didn't do anything. Hey, you all right? As fine as I'll ever be. He's doing a decent job. Maybe you're more than a rabbit after all. Okay, go left. There's a way around. All right, Something thank you for that. The edge of the crater. A tree is blocking my view. All right, then I'll just go investigate it for myself. I see it. About 13 meters from your position. Two o'clock. What's keeping you? Come on. No, do not shoot the child. Circle it from the left. It's still there. Targeting. Come here, child. I don't want to hurt you. I want to say hello. Be here. Watching you. You're going down, you little fucker. Leave after a dark yard. There's no way around. The hell there you go. Oh, wait. I don't think I should shoot him. Come on, come on, come on. Right. I, I, no, I can tell. Yeah. It's like yeah. it's been designed for me to only go one way. Wait a second, where are you? Oh, hi there, child. How you doing? What are you doing? Come on, I got ya. Oh, Jesus, you're horrifying. Welcome back to Slavland with a metro. Uh, this went out pretty well. I think might be able to do two levels of mission. A video, I should say. <laughs> oh god, I can't even speak now. Uh, well, um, yeah, but two, two missions of video, possibly, depending on how things goes. But, mm, not really much to say. Met Anna. At first, she doesn't seem likable, but she grows on you, depending on how you are. Uh, of course, though, she called me Rabbit. But enough of my rambling. If you guys enjoyed, think about leaving a like and a comment down below as always. Feel free to share the video if you want. And subscribe. Give me a trial run. I really appreciate that. And until next time, this is The Unknown Assembly, signing off. <laughs>